I make friends. Yeah. It brings me sage. Yeah, clear that air and get all that energy out. <laughs> Would you be, well. <laughs> started with our would you rather questions I took pictures of the ones that I thought were good okay yeah because it's like book related mm. would you rather be stuck in a romantic comedy with your worst enemy or in a horror movie with your best friend a horror movie with yes <laughs> absolutely <laughs> I would not want to be yeah no. no because it's like is in the romantic comedy are you and your worst enemy enemy the main characters like, are you guys the ones that have to fall in love and... I mean, if you do enemies, lovers, and it could be kind of... Oh my god. A drunk. There you go. I'm just seat up. No, I'm not. Because I have a lot of enemies. way taller than you. You have a lot of enemies. No, I don't. Oh, I was like, what? <laughs> I was like, who? No. The sun will go down eventually if it's bothering you. I apologize in advance. <laughs> Would you rather be able to speak every language in the world or be able to talk to animals? I've asked this at work before. Really? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. I've thought really long and hard about this. I think every language in the world. Really? I would do animals. No, I can't talk to animals, but I would like to be able to talk to other people. Mm. And then not sound like an idiot whenever I travel mm. somewhere else. And it would be nice because I feel like sometimes I don't travel or don't think about traveling certain places. Because, because of the language. Because yeah. I'm like, I would feel so uncomfortable. Yeah. And if I could just whip out, mm -hmm. that would be nice. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Yeah. But it's like with animals, this is going to sound really bad, but like with animals, like if I wanted to talk to Chesney, is there like an off? Like, you know what I mean? Right. Like, like are you going to hear them in the middle of the night? Is she just going to talk to me yeah. like all day long? Yeah. But I really don't want to hear squirrels outside. Okay, but that's, I guess that's a good question. Is it like it's all you animals. talk to animals? You can talk to, so is it like uh, you initiate the conversation or is it like you're just hearing every... I don't know. The way I've thought about it is you hear every conversation. Well, then no. I do language. You can't turn them off. Yeah. Because squirrels. Yeah. Be crazy. Birds. <laughs> oh, absolutely not. <laughs> What's another one? They chirp at 4 a.m. <laughs> can you imagine? <laughs> Instead of hearing singing, you're hearing like... Good morning! Good morning! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, would you rather have the ability to be invisible or to read people's minds? Okay. I struggle with this one because, like, reading people's minds sounds great. It's really intrusive. But I'm already anxious as it is trying to think about what you're yep. saying. Yep. I can't imagine you really are thinking that. And I'm like, oh, it's true. Although yeah. it would kind of maybe relieve some anxiety because you're like, well, <laughs> it is what it is. <laughs> That's different. I just feel like, okay, well. Right. Yeah, I think I'd be invisible. Would you rather have a knife when you need a spoon or a spoon when you need a knife? Hold on, I got it. Would you rather have a knife when you need a spoon or a spoon when you need a knife? That is awful. I'd rather have a spoon when I need a knife. I don't want oh, to eat oh, off like of a what? knife. Okay. If you're oh eating cereal. Yes. You God, you know how hard that would be? You have to really choose your cereal wisely. <laughs> like, well, that would be like balance. We did. Okay, but the question is, what kind of knife? Butter knife or a butcher knife? I don't want that. Because if it's a butcher knife, you got a lot of <laughs> surface area. But you're going to hurt yourself. Yeah. And, you, and, your, and your bowl, it's not going to fit in the bowl. <laughs> yeah, but a spoon you can't cut. I saw someone cut pancakes with a spoon. <laughs> Ooh, on Curb Your Enthusiasm, we were rewatching it. Oh, I've never she seen that you show. Get, you get the maximum syrup if you eat your pancakes. Oh, that makes it. That makes sense. Food for thought. You learn something new every day. Eat your <laughs> but I saw her cutting pancakes and spoon. I was like, well, maybe in dire situations you could use it. No. <laughs> Would you rather have two long front teeth like a beaver <laughs> or no teeth at all? <laughs> two long front teeth. Yeah, but that I'm is... not drinking liquids. Yeah, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy your milkshake. No, I... Mm. As long as I can hide in, the, in my mouth. Okay, but question. If they're not on. Do you... Wait. I'm good. Beaver, it's not saying all your other teeth are gone. Because I was thinking if it's only those two front no, ones... No, you still I have all your other teeth. But you still have all your other teeth. 
just but how do you on. chew? Just... Like, you got them all set. <laughs> I can't. Okay. I just couldn't. You can't even talk if you. I mean, you could probably. Yeah. You could probably sound funny. With teeth down to your chin. Could you get dentures? Or go to the dentist and just oh. shave them down. <laughs> oh, sure. They have a sander. <laughs> right. <laughs> Would you rather have to use shrimp? I like the way they said flavored. Shrimp flavored toothpaste? Or deodorant that smells like cheese? Ew. <laughs> shrimp flavored toothpaste is shorter. Yeah. And then if you it's only two minutes. But it's then if you sweat, minutes. is it stinky cheese? Yeah, I'm not doing the cheese. What kind of cheese? Is it sharp? Is it provolone? Is it... No, shrimp flavored toothpaste is fine. It's only four minutes a day. Mm -hmm. Would you rather a ding sound every time you wink? Or a pow pow sound every time you make a finger gun? I don't do either one. <laughs> Me neither. I can't <laughs> wink and I'd never go... <laughs> I can't wink. I can't. I'm not even going to attempt because people are going <laughs> to ruin me. I can, this is the best I can do. <laughs> <laughs> this one I cannot. Jacob makes fun of me all the time. You'd yeah. rather speak, only speak in riddles or only speak in rhyme? Oh, God. Rhyming would be kind of funny. You'd be like Dr. Seuss. Yeah. I'd but do the, I'd do the you rhyme. Know how much you'd have to say? be like a song. Yeah. Yeah, I do. You have to think too much for the riddles. Or it's like being a rapper. And everyone would never know what you're talking about. True. They'd have to, like, guess. Like, they'd have to... Yeah, it's uncomfortable. Yeah, no. I don't know about that. Would you rather spend a week in the woods without a tent? Mm-mm. Or one night in a real haunted house? Oh, no. The woods. <laughs> the woods. I'm not doing a haunted house. <laughs> no. One night in a real haunted house. Mm-mm. We do the haunted house. Yeah. It's one night. I don't like being out in the elements. Wait, how how long is the it's woods? It's a week in the woods. Oh, God. One night in a haunted I house. I thought it was one night in the woods. I, was, I would still choose the haunted listening. house for a week. I'm sorry. You could at least make friends with the ghosts. Oh, God. Show them what I'm reading. <laughs> hey, what's happening to you? <laughs> exactly. All my thriller books. No, yeah. yeah. Well, can I have a friend? <laughs> Done day. If I could have a friend, I would do the haunted house. Yeah. I'd make friends. Yeah. It brings me sage. Yeah, clear that air and get all that energy out. <laughs> do you rather have a unibrow or no outbrow? <laughs> <laughs> would you rather have a unibrow or no, no eyebrows. eyebrows at all? No, I, have you ever Googled celebrities with no eyebrows? Yeah, they look that oh my intentionally God. shave them Anne off. Anne Hathaway? Yeah. It's they crazy. shave them off for stuff. Yeah, I don't like it. A unibrow? God, that's bad. You can plug it. But can you? Because, like, so when I do these with, like, well, not all these, but if I do these with my class, I'm like, no, it's, you got, you got that. I think I'd rather have a unibrow because it's a little bit more accepted now than no eyebrows at That's all. true. That's true. No, I, no eyebrows, you just But, like, crazy. if people are super blonde. Yeah, like, my sister didn't have eyebrows could, for a long time. Oh, could you, like, fill them in? You could probably fill them in. But then it looks weird if you just draw one. Yeah, it looks like Sharpie. Unibrow. Unibrow. Would you rather always forget to buy one thing at the grocery store or always buy five things you don't need? Well, that's me anyways. I already buy five things. He, Jacob tells me all the time, we don't need this and this and this. And we got three things of oats that we haven't used. Yeah, that's, that's already oh. me. So, Oops. <laughs> But it's like, I'm like, well, in my head, I'm like, I'm going to make recipes with oats this week. And then, I, and then I don't. <laughs> Those aren't as good as we think they are. I tried to make smoothies with oats. You know it's not good. Mm. Well, maybe I won't make those recipes. See, could you imagine if you hear this for right now? No. Although, look at him. He's just eating his little nut. Look at him. Aww. This little nut is so good. Stop. <laughs> Stay young physically. Or stay young mentally. Mentally. Mentally, yeah. I don't want to lose it. Also, reading. <laughs> memories. You got our priorities, okay? I have my memories. Yeah, no, I can't do, like, losing. No. No, no, no. Like, also, I'm just Yeah, no. That's so sad. Like, I can't. Yeah, I can't. Would you rather be able to forget your worst memory or mm. remember your best memory but better? Who would not choose that one? 
I don't know. Some worst memories can haunt you. Because sometimes, you yeah. know, when you're driving down the street and you remember that thing that happened seven years ago. Yes. <laughs> yes. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Like, my best memory, like my wedding, that stuff you don't forget. Right. Yeah, I'd do the Drop worst pictures. one, probably. But I don't know, because I can't think of a worst memory either. Yeah. Like, so maybe like my if, best one. Right now, I would choose probably my best one. Yeah. Because if they were like, okay, worst memory right now. I wouldn't know what well, I'd be like, mm. Watch me be like, you know, something so Pee my small. pants in kindergarten. Right, like something, yeah. Oh my god, would you rather be always stressed or sad? I'm always both. Right. <laughs> if I, I had to choose, god. I would always be stressed. But that is awful. But being stressed makes me sad sometimes. But being sad all the time? Oh, I never be smile. Sad all the time. That's, no, that's... I'd rather be stressed. I'm already always stressed. Yeah. Oh, I hit my move goal. Yeah, I stopped wearing my watch. Oh, I was going to say. I, I got a notification. Yeah. I was like, oh, no. I think I'm going to get an aura ring. Oh, I want one. They don't track your activity, though. They don't have my size. Three and a half. Whatever. <laughs> Literally. so skinny. I can't. Would you rather drop a bad habit or gain a good one? I would want it to be both. Probably <laughs> gain a good one. Yeah, no, I don't want to gain it. Because then I feel like your good ones could outweigh your bad ones. Yeah, my worst habit is probably bite my nails. Mm, we've had... Tearing them. <laughs> yeah, I literally, I literally peeled three of my nails on the way here. I'm not showing this. We have either. had this struggle since middle school. Yeah. That's bad. I've been biting my nails ever since I got teeth, I think. <laughs> okay. Would you rather give up social media or be an influencer? Ew. Ew, ew, ew. Give up social media, I think. Okay, so I feel like people watching this would be like, Sarah, you would want to do an influencer. No. I would not. I gave, I'm in my social media detox right now and I'm loving it. But vlogging is different. Vlogging is different. And that's what I was talking about this morning on the way to school. YouTube and Pinterest for me mm -hmm. are not social media. Yeah. They are, but, but they're really. like yeah, healthy scrolling. social media. Like they're creative, positive social media. Yeah. And then there's like Instagram and Facebook and Twitter and whatever, TikTok. or X or whatever it's called yeah. now, TikTok. And that's like yeah. a deep, dark rabbit hole mm -hmm. of overwhelming information and like bad news and stuff. Mm -hmm. And then if you're an influencer, that's your job. You do it all the time. You're like, always on it. I feel like it's different if you make videos, if you're like a YouTuber. I don't feel like that's an influencer. But now because, a lot of influencers are doing YouTube. Right. So, but yeah, I'd much rather give up social media. But yeah. I guess my question is, is this considered social media? No. Okay, as long as you don't say it. I mean, you're not influencing anything. Right. I mean, you're not persuading people to do right. something. Right. So it's not... It's just sharing. Yeah. It's just like sharing. Yeah. You're not like, go buy this... Right. This greens powder that I drink every morning. And I'm getting paid for it. Right. Because like it. I, you know, and you're obviously crack yourself like this morning. This. Yeah. Like this morning I was like, this is what I do for my makeup. I'm using color yeah. pop. Yeah. But that's like sharing. Like you share with you. Yeah. Like I share with you. Yeah. Hey, I love the Yeah. No. I yeah, I agree. You're not getting paid for it. And yeah. supporting a product that you don't really believe in. Right. Because I'm not getting paid for this, but I do this for fun. Yeah. As like a hobby. Yep. Lose your sense of smell or sense of taste? <laughs> sense of taste. Yeah. See, I would do smell. Well, okay, but taste? Mm, maybe not. Because, like, I can't eat gluten. And, like, when Jacob gets a Chick-fil-A sandwich, I make him <laughs> breathe on me. Because I'm like, oh, fried chicken. Like, <laughs> and then, like, if he gets nuggets, I'm like, like, and I'm not tasting it. I'm just smelling it. And then if I lose, if yeah, I, if I, I don't, my sense of smell is more important. Like I'd rather yeah. smell like candles or mm. like perfume, like a, yeah, oil stuff like that. Yeah, my taste is because if you cause then you can eat really healthy if you. Don't that's taste. what I was about to say. Because if you can't taste it, then it's like oh, like what's the point? In eat every chocolate? vegetable you hate. Yeah. Like, yeah. Would you rather begin every sentence with "Hey, jerk face"? Or end every sentence with, just kidding. <laughs> All right.
rather start with hey jerk face. Yeah, because if you if you could turn it into like your thing, like, like play, your like hey jerk face, I love you. <laughs> you know what I mean? Versus I love you. Just kidding. Like that takes it That's back. Horrible. Yeah. Or you look so good today. Just kidding. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I'd rather be like hey jerk face. You look great today. <laughs> Find gum stuck in your hair, or a huge spider. Gum. Really? Oh. My. Mm -mm. Spider. Ugh. I can stomp on that. It's in your hair, though. No, it's not. I thought it said in your hair. Wait. The spider is in your hair. Wait, 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 wait. If the spider is in your hair, gum. If the spider is on the ground, spider. Ew. See, I just thought a huge spider. No, you it's hanging a around. huge spider in your hair. Mmm. It's not easy to knock those out. But see, I think I still choose this. You have a tarantula on your head. Stop. It's got the fibers. Okay, but your hand touching my head kind of made it, <laughs> made it a little real. I'm not sure about my option and my choice anymore. I had a bug on my neck this morning on my walk with Charlotte. And the way the scream that I scrimped. Scrimped. <laughs> I got it on my neck. Yeah. Gum, yeah. Gum you can get out with what, peanut butter? Yeah. And I chop my hair off. See, normally, you know, anyway. Mommy. I mean, I could. She plays Sydney. I my hair out. Right. We go to the same hairstylist. <laughs> Shout out Sydney Styles. Love you. <laughs> Would you rather meet someone famous from history or meet someone famous from a book? Like a book character. I don't know. Maybe. Probably history. Who would you choose? I have no idea. No. I really don't know who I would choose. You know who I would choose from history. Well, it's not. Audrey Hepburn. Yeah. I was yeah. going to say it's not history, but. She's. I mean, she is, but it's more fashion history, not like. Oh, I mean, history world in general. War, yeah, yeah. I know. I would. I would like to have lunch with Audrey Hepburn. I think that would yeah. be nice. Would you rather have five good friends or one best friend? I know my answer. I don't know because I have a lot of good friends. Mm -hmm. Because like every like I don't know like all my friends are so different. Yeah, and so you can do different things together. That's true. But I feel like, for me personally, your best friend is someone who's just like you. Yeah. So, like, no matter what you do, you're going to yeah, enjoy that's true. it. that's true. That's how I see it. I don't know. What if something happens to your own best friend, then you have no one? That is true. I didn't think about that one. That's a little dark, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> then think about, like, middle school. I feel like it was... I had one best friend through school, I feel like. Like, I mean, it changed. Right. Because I was going to say, I feel like in middle school, it was you and me. Yeah. 24-7. Yeah. Like, yeah. you and me. Yeah. And sleep then like high school, whenever, after you moved to after me. And yeah. Emma. I have more friends now as an adult than I ever did as a kid. Mm. You think it's because you moved out of small, out of a small uh, town? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's how I felt. <laughs> Not um, as many judgmental people. Yeah. I don't know. Because I it probably depends on the time of my life too. Yeah, because I I really think about like middle school is like core memories for me with you. Yeah, and it's like sleepover. Yeah, pink if ice, I go back to think of like that, Mickey Mouse pink Club, ice. Like, okay, so quick story. <laughs> when we were in middle school, Hannah Montana came out, and we were like, oh my god. How cool would it be if we wore wigs and we sang and no one knew at school and like we could be famous and there was a show called Can You Do It? And we were like, oh my God, we should go on the show. Now, I don't know about you, but I'm not a good singer. So like, I don't know what I was thinking. And I remember sitting in her room at her house and we, we wrote a song. Mm -hmm. We wrote a song in a notebook. <laughs> And then we were like, oh my god, what would the name of it be? And we came up with pink eyes. We were going to get blonde wigs because we both have yes. naturally brown hair. Yes. Contacts because I have brown eyes and you have blue eyes. Yeah, we were going to switch eye colors and then get blonde wigs, which is crazy because on my fair skin, that would... Uh -uh. <laughs> and we... But what's crazy is we believed it so much. Oh, yeah. But, you know... I kind of love it. Like, that's, like, shows yeah. our innocence. Yeah, I know. Like, we You're literally so thought we could wear wigs, sing, <laughs> and no one would know in, like, an interview if we talked. Like, oh, yeah, we're pink eyes. No pink one would. <laughs> also, the name just screams 2000s. Pink eyes. 
Yeah. Why did we? I don't know. There's nothing ice. Wasn't that the other name of the Claire store? Wasn't it called ice or something? And we were like, I don't know what it was. <sighs> it's like ice. Like jewelry or something. Yes. I don't know. It's something to do with sparkles or something, I think. Okay. Obviously, it didn't work out. No. <laughs> we we got that real, real, real quick. Yeah. My answer. Growing up, one best friend. Oh, I forgot. I was going to say, what was the question? Growing up, one best friend. Yeah. That's really good and, and now important. Five and good now ones. five good friends. Yeah. We met... Well, we originally met when we were like three years old. Right. Star Steps. So... Or gymnastics or something. Cheer Quest camp. for Life. Cheer, yeah. Cheer Camp so, and Quest for Life. So at our like rec center... No, not rec center. It was a gym. It's a gym. It was like the only gym in our small town. We apparently did a cheer camp together, but we didn't know each other. And then we met in middle school. In middle school, in sixth grade. In sixth grade, yeah, with my headband and my little black tees, little black t-shirt, little black tees. I remember like you just wearing like a little black white, a little black shirt, and a little headband. That's how we're staring. I, I like, wore a headband every day. Yeah. Like I, I remember. A boy in our class was, I remember I didn't wear a headband one day, and he was like, where's your headband? <laughs> and that's when I knew I, I had overdone it. I never wore one again. <laughs> I was like, nope. And then I started straightening my hair. No. Turn into your mom or your dad I've for the day. I've already turned into my mom. I know, same. I'm literally my mom, which is not a bad thing. But I'm also my dad. Same. I'm, I'm that, you know, that mix. mix. But if I could choose one... Probably my mom. Really? Yeah. She has a bustling social life. I mean, so does my dad. No offense mm. to if he watches. My mom's having a social life. <laughs> I life. doubt your dad is watching my vlog, but Mitch, <laughs> if you are, I hope you're doing well. Um, I would do it. Yeah, I would say my mom. Also, would you rather your significant other be best friends with your ex or best friends with their ex? My ex. Yeah, same. So we've been doing this forever because we started with the sun <laughs> and now it's pitch black. Okay. Would you rather go back in time to meet your ancestors or go into the future to meet your great grandchildren? Ooh. Hmm. I was going to say great grandchildren, but I wish I was able to meet my, like my mom's mom died when she was five mm. from colon cancer. And then my dad's dad died when he was 16. So I never met them. Mm. So, like, I really don't know my grandma. Yeah. Because, like, it's it's my mom's stepmom. Yeah. So, like, technically she's not even my grandma. I mean, she right, is. Right. But it would be really it would be really nice to meet those blood mm -hmm. relatives. Because I'm pretty sure my grandpa is my dad. Like, they're the same. Because <laughs> he's the first. He's, mm -hmm. And my dad's the second. William's the third. But the great-grandchildren, that would be cool. Yeah. What would you choose? Ancestors. Really? I kind of don't know if I'm going to have kids. So, that's, mm. yeah. It kind of scares me, though, great-grandchildren, because it's like... They could be... They could be tears. <laughs> well, that. But then also, like, the way the world is right now, hopefully... I mean, it could be really great, and you meet them, and you're like, wow, so much has changed, like, for be the miserable. better. Or they could be... Yeah. Living in shipping containers all stacked up on each it. other. Stop mm Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I would do ancestors. Yeah, I would do ancestors. Just because I would have loved to have meet those actual grandparents. Yeah. Hope you enjoyed that little session. Don't know how long this vlog is going to be. Now with this, I will, we will edit and see. But if it's really long, then I might just do a little Wednesday to Friday. Yeah. And then you get double the content. You get a little...